Miss China Monet, Miss China Monet, are you there? Are you able to pop your camera on? Yes, I'm in the building. Hello. All right, word, word. Thank you for joining. Are you are you able to uh to put your camera on? Join us. Yes, here I go. All right, there she go. There she go. All right. Where we at today? <laughs> where where you checking in from? Oh, I'm checking in from Atlanta. Okay, ATL in the building. Um, is is that how you and uh heard uh connected? Yes, I met him in Atlanta. He came to join the Ugly Money team with us, but he's from Vegas. Yeah, yeah, for sure. No, no, we we from had heard on here a bunch of times. Yeah. Heard, heard Raymond what, T. Yeah. What's happening with his family? Heard, heard <laughs> actually from the Bay. Heard actually I'm from the Bay, know. China, but it's all good. <laughs> oh, I know that. <laughs> heard, heard the worldwide traveler. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, but uh, lo love on the record, man. You know we already got it up on the Digi website. So thank you for uh being able to join us today. You know what I mean? Um, I don't know if you caught any of the conversation. I I, I was hoping we didn't scare you off. You know what I mean? No, <laughs> You know, I was having uh, internet problems. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, yeah, nah, just interesting convo today around viral and and balance of positive records and maybe stuff that's not great for the culture. You know what I mean? So, um, love to hear any of your thoughts on everything because you know you definitely got a different record going right now. Yes, I most definitely feel like it's a time to change the narrative in the music game. Period, because it's definitely very influential influential on our kids and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Like everybody feel like it's okay to be a three oh four, which is a hoe. And it's not like I mean I'm I'm only one to one man. You feel me? You could be like that to one guy, but don't feel like it's okay to do it to the world. You know what I'm saying? So I came that's why I came playing this record to like switch it up. Like it's okay to be submissive. It's okay to be able to um sit down, stand down with a man and let a man leave. Instead of making a man feel like he don't need, like you don't need him or he can't do his part as being a man. And that's what like, a lot of this music is going, making our women feel like they're independent and we don't need a man. Fuck that nigga this and fuck that nigga that. And, uh, all that is not true because I do and I want one. <laughs> that's right. So, so for you then, this, you, the, I, so I'll put it this way because I talk about from the men's side of hip hop. We get the wannabe gangster, right? Everybody got to be tough. Yeah. So from the from the women's side, and I've said this many times before, what are you talking? Cardi B's, your Megan Thee Stallions, your Lottos. Um, they they push in, like you said, the narrative of a 304, but they go home and be a faithful woman. You know right. what I'm saying? So so they push in a, a narrative of this other shit for image and popularity, but that's not necessarily how they're living. Exactly. So, so for you, with this record submissive that we're about to play, this is really you. You, you ain't really in the three. Yeah. This ain't the three or four. You want a man. You want. You want to be. You know what I mean. Tie. I don't want. And I don't even want to use the word submissive like in a bad thing because yeah, for whatever reason right. that is that has got turned into. You know what I mean. Whatever. Right. Today. <laughs> I know some people think when you hear the word submissive like you're being weak. Oh, she weak because she's submissive. No, it's just I'm not. I'm bringing out my feminine energy. I don't want to be masculine. <laughs> Yeah, you could be strong without being masculine. You know exactly. what I'm saying? You know, so cool, cool. Well, listen, man, I, I know uh, you kind of, you know, you you tied up a little bit. So uh, we're going to play this record with everybody. I'm, I think everybody's kind of familiar with the record, but um, definitely, yeah. like I said, just want to uh, run it back because uh, I think it fits definitely with the with the conversation that's been very, very heavy today. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. um, again, if y'all ain't familiar, uh, you know, China Monet, the song Submissive going up. Uh, peep game, everybody. Yeah. Hey, Flea Wood, cut that shit up, nigga. Ah, you bitches keep starring shit, but can't keep a motherfucking man. Bitch, I'm. All you bitches kept and say you'll need a man. Leaving when he building, but you need a plan. It's a miss of women in demand, too. I'm nothing like that drum you put your man through. I say I cook, I clean, I fuck. Pussy ran through. That's why your baby daddy can't stand you. Ay, keep some clothes on, leave them curious. That's why these niggas don't take you serious. What's your body count, ho? I bet you shut up. And if you told the truth, I bet he never. All that whole shit, it ain't respect. Get your shit together, yeah, perfect. When them bills late, you gon' be crying to them niggas. Tryna find you a nigga, spend time with a nigga. 
When you get some money outside on a nigga fucking one, two, three, four, five of his niggas. All you bitches cap and say you'll need a man. Leaving when he building, but you need a plan. It's a miss of women in demand, too. I'm nothing like that drum you put your man through. No, nah, what my boy has hey Russ say, not that's the one, not the two, gang. <laughs> Most definitely. <laughs> All right, man, that that hit kind of thick. I ain't gonna lie, you know what I'm saying? Definitely a, a different era than what is getting the uh the look today. So again, man, just want to thank you for joining the call. Definitely want to uh invite anybody who's got questions. Uh, tap in China. Uh, shoot, I'm 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 rooting for you to find that man, China. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> thank you so much. Now I'm definitely appreciate y'all, man. Everything. Um, how, how long you actually been getting at this? Because I've been, you know, I was kind of just dipping around in the YouTube. I seen you got, you know, you got a, a good little catalog of songs out there. So, um, um, three years. Okay, okay. Yeah, three years. Excellent, man. Well, this seems to be the one that's catching. So very cool. Most you definitely. know what I'm saying? Indeed, <laughs> indeed. Um, Miss Tammy Marie, Miss Tammy Marie, smoking away. What you doing? Yeah, I like the joint. Um, check it out, man. That shit got me ready to fucking pop open a bag of noodles. Bust out the fabuloso, but I'm telling you, I ain't shutting up. I will not shut up. I'm sorry. Well, you ain't got to shut up. Don't okay. shut up. But yeah, you keep doing it. I like that. Thank you so much. <laughs> See, and that's the thing I think, like, it's definitely a conversation starter, right? Because mm -hmm. she, she with all of that shit, but she don't want to shut up. And that's you know a I mean? lot of people that tell me that, yeah. They, they ain't shutting <laughs> up. They ain't about, I ain't trying to say just shut up and, you know, don't speak your peace, but, you know, just don't be argumentative. That's all. I know you could have healthy debates. You know what I'm saying? That's 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 what it is. You know what I mean? That's why I say, like, you know, we were talking about that earlier, and even with the um, you know, where the state of music is at today. Um mm -hmm. how maybe so, so that one right there, and I'm sure when you drop the visual to that, that one's gonna go crazy. You know oh, what yeah, I'm saying? Before I even dropped the record, it was already getting like 300k views, probably 400 now on Facebook, 200k on uh Twitter. Like it's going crazy. <laughs> Just yeah, the piece I mean, of content I had put out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nah, no, nah, super dope. Um, you know, and, and like I said, I, I, I like the fact that you know you're trying to change the narrative around submissive, you know what I mean? Because it, it doesn't mean weak, you know. Exactly. There's, there's something that has definitely been lost in relationships today. So, you know, we gotta hear the other side. You know, we we talk about it all the time in balance, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Uh Cuddy, Cuddy, chime in, bro. What's good, China? Cuddy hey. West from Jersey. Yo, that yeah. shit, I, I was the first time I heard that. That shit is hard as fuck. That, that shit is hard. Good. I'm supporting that to the fullest. You feel me? Um, We was definitely, like, what, like the fellas were saying, we was having a heavy conversation about that. Like, mm -hmm. And that was the perfect execution oh. of what I think is a part of the answer, where it's like, in the normal sense of where a girl would have been saying be submissive, that shit would have been some R and B shit, or would have yeah. been on some, or was some boom, some boom bap, like mm -hmm. positive, like, and it wasn't that. That shit came just as hard as any <laughs> other bust that pussy open shit. But we, exactly. we talking about this. Nah, that was hard. You know, you got my support. I'm out the fire. I'm subscribing. Everything, gang. I, I fuck with you, heavy. Yeah, if you ever in Jersey, we locking in. Like, we gotta, Most we gotta make, we gotta get you out there so other girls can hear that shit too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like. We gotta bring that out. That's that's like the perfect execution. That's dope. Like it's crazy. You just came on the call today. So you know what I mean, so yeah, that's crazy. It happened today. So you know what I mean, more power to you. I'm definitely rocking with you. Man, loves me. Good luck. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna write it to you. Yeah, make sure I get everybody. Know. All right, see that. Follow y'all. Most definitely want to do some drops for some DJs and stuff too. So y'all tap in. For sure. China, are you oh, yeah. familiar on how to uh put your info in the chat? Um no, let me see. Or maybe maybe her uh ace, maybe you could do that for her. Just maybe drop the IG email, whatever, whatever, you know what I 
Yep, everything China Monet. Yeah, I'm that ain't gonna do it. Chat. Yeah, DJ, that ain't gonna DJ do it. Pack is in the chat <laughs> as well. That ain't gonna do it. <laughs> there we go. Okay, there you go. She got it. She got it. What up, see? No, nah, I'm gonna say everybody else wants to get a drop from her for sure. Or a I think customs will go far. You know what I'm saying? Some people want to get their girl's name in the record. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, but, <laughs> but I would put, I would put, uh, if you want to get a uh, drop from China, just make sure you put your info in the chat. That way they can yeah. handle that. My my stuff was real quick. I mean, again, just going up with the intensity of the conversation today. Thank you. You know, because we sort of needed that. Um, and we need this record. My thing to everybody is, are you going to support it? And how do we get it to go, you know, go beyond where it is now? You know what I mean? Because um, we we talk a lot. What are we really doing, you know, to really to really break these records? So that's all I have to say. Um, great job. And um, thank you. Stand on your principles and morals. It's dope. Most definitely. I appreciate y'all. Chime in, Punch. All right. I'm going to make it quick. First off, hey, China. Hey. <laughs> I told him he was gonna get you on here. So look, I want I, I salute to my Digi Wax family, and I told y'all, and I'm gonna leave it there. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Gary Archer, Bay Flavor, what's happening, G? Man, I'm gonna make it quick too. I'm just gonna say, man, I'm gonna run that shit up out here in Oakland, the Bay Area, and you know, I have a huge influence on my DJ friends. I love to bring shit from other markets in my market and turn shit up. That shit go crazy. Oakland is going to lose their fucking mind over that record. I promise you. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Oh, no, you know, oh, oh, that no, shit Gary. crazy. Hey, Gary, them Oakland women is different, though. You know what I'm saying? The Bay Area women is different. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, I think you nothing, say nothing that. submissive nah, about them, G. That's going. <laughs> nah, nah, you don't understand. And the, the real ones are the real ones. Like, like there's a lot of, you know, just like China Monet said, like, don't get it fucked up. These women in the Bay are players. They bosses. And they understand in order to be really successful, you need motherfuckers on your team that you don't have to look around. You know, they looking forward. And that only comes from a relationship where people trust each other and love each other. So, like, real bosses know that in Oakland. Yeah, there's a lot of little girls trying to trying to play this game everyone else is playing. But they want to grow up and be bosses. I promise. Thanks. Yeah, man. X squad, X squad, you there? I think you on mute, G. All right, big All right. red, big big red, we'll come to you. I want to say, uh, I'm be quick with it. Hey, good song. Uh, like the the submissive thing, you know, like you said, the <laughs> shadow point, like I said, the shadow point. <laughs> hey. I, I dig that because I understand what you mean by that. I really right. do. I understand, like you said, get your point of cup, but sometimes you just gotta, shh, you know what I mean? To, 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 You'll go far. Put the fire <laughs> a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Put the fire a little bit. I feel you for that one. I like it. I run them. You know, I'm DJ Big Red out of Dallas, Texas. So, you know, I'll run it up for you too. You know what I mean? Thank you. Thank you. Keep it going. Yeah. Keep doing what you're like doing. Most definitely. Yes, indeed. <laughs> All right, so China, I want to ask you the question because you know, um, you know, we talk a lot about uh music versus like viral and content today. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you you talking about this kind of all, was already getting a viral way before the song even kind of really officially got put out there, right? Um, how much of that discussion is going on like within your camp and, and your team like that? Like I I'm just I'm just envisioning when they, when you finish that song and pen that song, he was like, yo, this this could take off. You know what I'm saying? Oh no, I knew it was most definitely gonna start a conversation. Because, like you said, nowadays, women not on it. Women's like, fuck that nigga, and I'm a boss bitch. And, like, basically downing our men and making it seem like they can make it fall without a man. But, no, it, it started some heat. That was really got it going, That the conversation. It started a conversation. What has kind of been the consensus? Is it like 50-50 or? or... Um, no, the man is most definitely rooting for me right now. I mean, come on. You you, you know, we, we, probably got, we probably got a woman on our team. All we, all we ever get is toxic, toxic masculinity. Y'all <laughs> you know yeah, finally got y'all advocate. <laughs> but yeah, the men, yeah, they most definitely going more than the women. It's some women, though. It's some. But it's mainly the men pushing it. Is that right? Wow. Wow, that's uh, that's interesting. I mean, that's a sign of the times. I think a little bit, you know, like you said, man. So, 
Um, what's the word right there in ATL, man? You uh, you getting the DJ starting to pick this up a little bit? Oh yes, um, it's been on one hundred seven point nine FM radio. Um, I got some DJs out here working with me. DJ Stepticon, um, uh, even Sway, the remix God. He been looking at it and stuff, so it's most definitely catching out here too. Hell yeah! No, I mean, I I think the cool part, like I said, you know, you have a a message in there on the contrary to what's been going on, but you still can get out there and pop pop to that record. You know what I mean? Yes. So that record works in a lot of different atmospheres. You know? So yeah. <laughs> No, for sure. Still a turn up record for sure for fun. Bionic, Bionic, I'm 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 confused why you so quiet, G. You ain't got nothing to say on the record, Bionic. Oh, now I'm in the middle there. of doing a photo. Oh, no, no, no. I'm in the middle of doing a photo shoot. So I'm talking to y'all in between things. So uh, <laughs> but nah, I rocks with the record. Like as soon as the record hit, I just busted out laughing because I was like, this is exactly what I'm talking about. This is what's needed. <laughs> There needs to be a narrative change to what the sound of positivity is. Positive doesn't need to be relegated to a certain sound. So I can dig it. I can rock with it. And it's one of those things of like everybody has already said everything. You know what I'm saying? It's one of the things where it's like, yo, run that. The record is strong. The beat is strong. It gets folk moving, dancing, all that other stuff. And the message is there. Let it ride. Let it rock. And it's your message. If somebody else don't want to hear it, then they can live, wait till they song come on. But as for me and my folk right now, we rocking this. I appreciate it. <laughs> uh, your ex-squad, did you get your mic working? Okay. Uh, there we go. There you go. We can hear you now. Yep, now we can hear you. Yep. We could hear you, G. Can you hear us? All right, nope. Black, <laughs> Black man rising. Step in, step in. Yeah, I just wanted to say, Queen, that I, I love the joint, and I want to just add the reason it give me that same major feel that, you know, the same twerk, like if it was a Doja Cat or a Cardi, but yeah, it did give a different message to give you an option. The only option for young fine, you know, artists is I'm about to break you, strip club, magic, all that shit. And mm -hmm. you actually give us the same vibe, but with a different message. So I'm fucking with you. I already emailed your manager for an interview and a drop. Um, much success, man. Keep it coming. And I'm definitely a new fan, baby girl. Thank you. Appreciate that so much. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, China man. Well, listen, um, what, what what's in the tank for the rest of the year? You we gonna continue just to kind of work this record for a time being, or you got oh, an well, album coming? Or? I got a whole EP coming. Um, submissive. I got like six records on there, and they're so fire. Like I got records harder than submissive. <laughs> I'm just so ready to put this message out because definitely I'm creating my own lane. And um, most most definitely want to shout out to the producer Fleetwood, the one who made the beat. Yes, he's um out there in North Carolina. Yeah, some yeah. more record working too. So, yeah, I definitely got an EP coming. So, y'all yeah, need to be looking out for it. It's called Submissive. Coming soon. And just more. I'm going to do more content just around this whole narrative. This missing narrative. Like, really push it. <laughs> for sure, man. For sure. And um, you, you said right now the video, because I was trying to track down the video. Um, I mean, is it's it actually not, um, a video? It's just like a content video. Like, it's no. Oh, okay. It's okay. Gotcha. Yeah. You gotcha. can look um it's on my Instagram, it's on Nietzsche page on um Facebook. Just look it up. It's just me and my um some girls. We in uh Sam's Club. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Nah, I can dig it. Nah, that's gonna be cool. Shopping for your man in Sam's Club. That's right. <laughs> All right, no. cool, man. Well, listen, listen, thank you so much for your time again. Shout out to the homie Ace, Mr. Be Heard, you know what I mean? Um, the whole um, what is it, uh Ugly Money? Ugly yeah. money. Is that is is that who you getting down with? Yes. Yeah, yes. Yes, she 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 is ugly money artist. The first, first ugly money artist. Okay. First side, that's big. That's big, her. Oh, mm -hmm. and also she got a podcast called Pretty Money. Y'all need to check that out. Oh yeah. It's lit <laughs> in a perspective on things that's going on. You'll love it. Hey, so I'm curious, China, are you actually getting hate from women around this song? Um, yeah. 
they bashing me. They going crazy. Uh, it's okay. I can take. I can take the criticism. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They yeah, just yeah. mad. They just triggered. I triggered them. That's all. So is it, is the next single gonna be called "Pick Me"? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just to, just to fuck with them and, and, and kind of you know what I'm saying, kind of fuck with them a little bit. Mm-hmm. I like that. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. I like that. Go ahead. Go ahead. I got you. Mm-hmm. Matter of <laughs> fact, hit me up. I'm a producer. Let's do it. Word, man. Well, listen, we got your info. Uh, heard we reach out to you, uh, trying to track down these drops. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I put my email in the chat. Yes, sir. I believe you. I believe you. I believe everybody here. Um, he dropped the DJ pack in the chat as well. Uh, but I know that's one. That one's up on the uh, DJ Wax website uh, already. Also, so uh, get out there, support the records. You know what I'm saying? We 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 talk this shit. You know what I mean? It's in our hands to get out there and and you know what I mean. P pushing for what they pushing for what they are. So, um, China, best to you. Uh, what's the timeline on uh, the, the submissive EP? Um, I haven't put no time on it yet. Not yet. Okay, before the end of the year, though. Before the end of the year. Yeah. All right, word. All right, mamas. Well, thank you for your time, man. Appreciate you, heavy. You know what I mean. Uh, keep you. doing your thing out there. We'll be definitely looking up for the EP. All right. All right, most definitely appreciate y'all. All, All right, bless up.